would happen if uh, we would abond abandon or not use the traditional approach to job interviews? Well, I think that if we abandon the traditional ways to approach to the job interviews, uh, maybe uh, there would be some people that's not good enough, but they have like they made up a good CV and mm -hmm. we will not know that. OK, uh, so we still need like three many rounds and a lot of ways to test like the weather. Yeah, whether yes, the candidate is that, yes, the candidate, whether they are good or not, or they're they are really fit with the, the company or not. Yes, so the writer believes. Number two. Number two, the writer believes that having substantial experience of job interviews puts you in a better position when you are asked tried and tested questions uh, my answer is not given it is not given number three even even candidates who have considerable interview experience may often be concerned by questions that have more personal tone uh, it, it is. is true what are some of the personal questions that um interviewees interviewees might ask um tell me more about yourself yes number four when asked number four when asked about oneself is useful to draw on detailed personal experiences to convey your character character it is character what do you it say it actually is false number five number five employers may often be wary of candidates to compare current and prospective jobs it is why, true yes it is true but the question is why do you think employers may often worry of these scenarios or of these candidates um um maybe uh compare current and prospective yeah maybe they will not tell the truth they will just i don't know like talk bad bad about bad, the bad thing previous yes, job about. So the, yes. the other job so the company will feel that they are the best or something like that yes and they would feel that they will also do the same when they try to find another job in the future <laughs> you know yeah. like telling something negative about the company